what do you think would be the first initial steps for a company that might not be so ethical to kind of turn that around and have, I guess, an ethical baseline? And what are some things that a company has to think about? Well, I think that they can, you, you, I, I think it gets a little unwieldy if you try to do too much too quickly, you know? So maybe you kind of look at one thing, whether it's the environment and is there a organization that you really uh, feel like you, your company aligns well with? And, you know, whether that is helping the rainforest, whether that's just helping climate change, um, you know, just do just start off doing good in some form or fashion. Uh, we have clients um, like Milkadamia, for example, which is a macadamia nut, nut milk company who- Smart name, great, love it. I, I know, I know, and their product's great. Sorry, that's all I'll hawk today, that's it. Uh, <laughs> but but um, they are very focused on regenerative farming, which is keeping uh, carbon in the soil and not letting it uh, go out into the atmosphere. Mm -hmm. And they're also very big on their products not being, not having palm oil. And I think we're starting over the past year to see the real damages of palm oil farming in Southeast Asia yep. and palm oil production and the toll that it's taken, not only on the environment there, but also the indigenous people who made their living for centuries on the forests, the rainforests there. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, for companies who are looking to do a toe dip into, you know, doing something good for the planet, look to see what you can get behind. Look to see what resonates with you. And, you know, and then just share what you're doing about it because it's the transparency is also very important because it's one thing to say we support trees. Mm -hmm. It's another thing to say how we support trees. You know, we plant a hundred trees for every hundred dollars spent or something, you know, you, yeah. but you have to be transparent and show people why you want to be believed and why this is important to you. 